What's up guys, Nerd Help Desk here and today I'm going to show you how you can get Flappy Bird on your Android device. If you're like one of the many people out there that want to download Flappy Bird even though it's been removed officially from the App Store and the iOS Store, any Android device actually can still download it with ease and I'll show you how you can do that today. Okay, on your Android device load up the settings and uh, this is going to differ per versions of Android, however it should be pretty similar. Go down into the security tab, go down and find where it says uh, uh, unknown sources. You want to check this and if it's not already checked, check it and you want to make sure that you can allow unknown sources. This is going to allow you to install package files not from the Play Store. In the description below I have uh, two links to the same e APK file. The APK file is basically the package file for Flappy Bird. I'm going to include two APKs, one on Mega and one on uh, Mediafire, so you can prefer, you know, have your preference there. Um, Mediafire doesn't use encryption, but it should be faster. Once you get the link loaded up in your phone, specifically we're just going to be using Mediafire, you can also use Mega if you prefer. You can click the download link here. It's going to tell you, uh, do you want to keep the file anyway? Click OK and then it's going to show up downloading in your notifications bar. Once it's downloaded, you can click on it and then uh, if you want to, you can uh, scan this with a um, Android antivirus if your phone has one. If not, go ahead and uh, I'm just going to go ahead and do a package install. So you're going to see uh, what it wants to install here and you click install. There you go. And now you have Flappy Bird even though it's removed. So thanks for watching guys. If you like this video, uh, make sure that you like it below and we have a lot more tech videos in our help desk. Thanks for watching.